Australian Formula One Grand Prix. Fantastic food, great to see my friends, and of course it's my home race. Melbourne, 5.3 kilometres, 58 laps, in all 308 kilometres. Six high speed stretches, two slow turns. Three ideal spots for overtaking, top speed 300 kilometres an hour. Okay, starting the lap here at the Melbourne, Australian Formula One Grand Prix in the Red Bull Simulator. Breaking for the first corner. We've seen many, many accidents here for the first lap of the Grand Prix. Accelerating hard away. Great section for the fans to watch the Formula One car in the first part of the lap. Accelerating away from the paddock now. Hard braking again for turn three. Overtaking opportunity. We've seen quite a few good fights here in the past. Now you need to find a good rhythm. Attacking the curbs a little bit, but also keeping the speed up. Very important corner, very fast right-hander with not much runoff. Braking very, very hard. Very important to get a clean exit out of there. We're coming now around the back of the lake. Very, very fast now, building the speed. Up to seventh gear, hard braking over a very, very bumpy entry point. Crucial exit is needed there for a good run onto the back straight. See the palm trees on the right, get a bit of a sensation for speed. Into a beautiful fast chicane in the back of the track, which all the drivers enjoy. And then coming towards the last sector now, we have two right-handers, one which involves heavy braking, accelerating away hard. The next one is a little brake, but very, very fast entry speed. Third last corner, very, very fast. No longer you're out of there and you're braking very, very hard into a left-hand hairpin. Very difficult to get traction out of here. Great view for the spectators again to watch the Formula One car. Finishing the lap across the start-finish line, hopefully for a good lap time.